For the phone interview or for networking, it's important to have a two minute elevator pitch prepared that gives an interviewer or someone you're connecting with some understanding of your background. For an interview, you should clearly communicate your relevant experience and tell a story of how you ended up interested in the role or the company. A good story here can help ease any apprehension that they have about your background. For example, if you don't come from a true technical background, this is a great place to talk about how you learned your technical skills. When interviewing, you should customize this elevator pitch for the job at hand. Pick and choose relevant details from your work life, your personal life, and your education that are applicable to the job that you're applying for. The structure of this elevator pitch should start with you thanking them for their time. Next, talk about your most recent and relevant work experience. After that, you want to explain why the job was particularly appealing to you. You can include relevant education, personal, and work experience that would make you a good fit for the role here as well. Feel free to share your personal interest in the company and why you're excited about their mission. For networking purposes, you can share a more general story. Depending on where you're at in your career, you'll only want to mention fairly relevant things. If you're a student, you'd want to talk about your studies and the clubs that you've joined or started. If you've been out of school for 20 years or something, it probably doesn't make much sense to spend too much time talking about the good old college days. For these, I recommend starting with where you are now and then giving a brief history of how you got to where you are. I would conclude this statement with some of the things that you're interested in and see if they have something in common. In general, you probably want to keep these a bit shorter than two minutes for networking purposes. Now we'll do a quick elevator pitch example for where I'm in a job interview and they're asking me about my background. And I'll also do one where I'm in a networking scenario. Hello, I know we just met, my name is Ken. And for the last three years, I've been working as a data scientist for a sports analytics focused consulting firm. Now in that work, I've helped coaches and teams improve their performance based on the data that's collected on them. Now, in this role, I focus mainly on golf and basketball. And in, in the role at your company, uh, a baseball team, you know, I'd really like to branch out and focus on a singular sport. Baseball was one of my passions growing up. And, you know, I played it in, in high school and I was looking forward to playing it in college until I got injured. And it's something I really wanted to circle back to from an analytics perspective. You know, through my college years, when I was studying economics, I was always trying to apply them first to baseball scenarios. That's really where I developed this love of data science and this passion. As I moved through my, my graduate studies, my computer science, my business studies, again, I focused a lot of my projects on, those, on, the, on the field of baseball. And I also actually was really watching as a fan as well. So I'm bringing to this role a true understanding of the sport from playing it, from analyzing it, and as a fan. So I think that that's something that perhaps is a bit more unique. You might not get all three of those buckets in, in, most, of your, uh, in most of your candidates. So the next thing that I think is, is valuable that, that, that I could bring to your organization is I've also had some really good experience in consulting. I've worked with directly with the heads of teams, the heads of organizations, and I've been able to communicate that with them very clearly and on an equal level. So I have no problem actually taking our insights and, and speaking them and communicating them up the chain of command. So again, you know, my background is really saturated with baseball. And I think that I would be a value and an asset to your team because of my subject area understanding there, as well as my technical capabilities. So in a more social setting, I'd probably go about uh, doing a pitch in a different way. So I'd start again with uh, my interest in sports analytics. So hello, my name is Ken. I'm the head of data science at a company called Scouts Consulting Group. We help athletes and teams improve their performance based on the data that's collected on them. So I got into sports analytics pretty early in my career. I played golf in high school and eventually in college. And I realized that I could actually improve my own performance by analyzing the data that I was collecting on myself. This really sprung board me into the sports analytics world because I saw the value that you could create from the data in sports. So you know, in college, I studied economics. In grad school, I studied business and then eventually computer science. I saw that in my analytics work that I was collecting for myself, 
it was getting more and more technical. I saw a huge value for computer science and actually programming. And so I decided to jump all in and actually learn these skills. So after, um, you know, after analyzing a lot of this data uh, and after going to school, I decided to get, go back and actually enter the consulting realm. I thought that that was a very interesting experience where I would learn a lot, but I quickly realized I wanted to do something a bit more technical. So that's when I hooked on with my current company and I've been there ever since doing a lot of this uh, work focusing on improving sports outcomes through the data science toolkit. I hope that this two minute pitch will be helpful to you. This is a very, very valuable tool for networking and professional scenarios. Know what you're gonna say, know it cold. I was ad-libbing a little bit because, you know, my story isn't gonna be useful to you guys. It's just an example.